Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, so in this video we're going to cover the warm up for your Defense 1.3 and 21.4 uh, workouts. Uh, Tim here is going to demonstrate some movements uh, that we're going to go over in the session later on um, to get you prepped and ready to rock and roll. So we're going to be looking at three, four minute EMONs here. We're about 60 seconds rest in between just so we can show you those movements as we progress. Uh, number one is going to be a four minute EMON as I said. It's going to be two, two movements. Move one is going to be some active Spider-Mans. So Tim's going to drop down to the top of the push-up position. Step one leg in. His inside arm is going to come down to the floor as close as possible and then extend and reach towards the ceiling. So we're getting a nice hip stretch there, getting those hips prepped for that squat. We're also getting some thoracic rotation in that spine uh, as we go through these reps. We're going to do this for about a minute. And if you jump up from there, when minute two starts, we're going to start off with some V-ups, okay, so getting ready for that movement in the workout. We're going to start with single leg ones though, so Tim's going to take one leg up at a time. His opposite arm is going to tap with that foot. We're still looking at teaching points here, so it's in the workout, we want that straight leg all the way through. We're going to do exactly the same here, touching that foot as well and not the leg. Good stuff. We're going to go through that for four minutes to set. We'll rest for about 60 seconds and then we're going to hit EMOM number two. So we go in, we've got four minutes. This time we're going to hit some baby makers. What's a baby maker, you might ask? This is a baby maker. We're going to reach down, grab and hold of the feet, stretching out that posterior to start off with, and then we're going to pull down into that squat again, stretching out those hips. We can spend a bit of time down here. We can lift that chest up nice and high. We can maybe push the knees out a bit more in the bottom position using those arms. All those things, good for the hips. It's nice. Cool, movement number two, we've got some shoulder taps and push-ups. So we're going to drop down, we're going to go for push-up to start off. And as we come up, we're then going to add in a shoulder tap on each side. Good stuff. If you want to make this a little bit easier, we can go for the push-up on the knees, okay? So keeping the knees on the floor, looking at that straight line between knees, hips and shoulders. And then taking the knees off as we go against that shoulder tap. So warming up those arms there, getting that pushing strength in and power. And we are adding in those shoulder taps for the movement that comes up in the workout. Resting again after those first four minutes, and then for the final four minute e we're going to get a little bit of sweat on here, so we're just going to go for some full air squats and then some burpees. So, minute one, we're just looking at air squats, nice little pace, having a little pause at the top as we want to do in the workout, giving ourselves that little rest chance to have a little bit of air uh, before we do those reps. And then, minute two, we're hitting some burpees. We can jump up, jump down. We can step down, step up, any way that you want to do it, as long as we're moving for like 60 seconds, getting nice and warm, getting the sweat up, getting the heart rate going, we're good to go. See you soon guys.